Yeah, hello and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time, thank you so much for joining me. I am doing this drop because I did another drop at the beginning of this actual video and I didn't like how I looked in that section. I actually like this section. I'm really cute. So hey y'all, hey y'all. Welcome to my channel. My name is Princess. If this is your first time, go ahead and like this video and subscribe because since we're all about motherhood over here in my life and everything else that you'll see on my channel, it's all about that. But mostly right now I'm talking about motherhood and my favorites on this video um so if you like videos like this go ahead and like this video go ahead and subscribe again if this is your first time my name is princess welcome 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 and thank you so much for joining me let's get right into this video so much for joining me if this is your first time my name is princess welcome 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 we're gonna jump right into the video pretty much this video is going to be about my favorites as a new mom again it's been five years since i or might as well say six because my son will be six in december um so it's been six years since my last child that i've even done any of this as far as like dealing with the newborn and um a lot of things you know during my first three children i didn't know what i know now and also i was younger i was in my 20s so it was like honestly sis was just you know still growing okay growing up <laughs> now that i'm at that age where youtube is you know you get a lot of information from youtube you get a lot of information from tiktok and instagram and a lot of hacks that other women are sharing and then also more people are just sharing their stories and sharing their journeys versus back then um so my first son i had him in 2010 my second I, my daughter I had her in 2013 my third child which is my second son I had him in 2017 so during those times YouTube was popping but it wasn't popping it like it is now as far as like finding different people such as myself and others who are um, sharing their journeys as far as trying to conceive um, the pregnancy journey and then also now in the fourth trimester the new journey the newborn journey so I want to share with you guys my favorites, what I found that's helped me these last nine weeks. My baby is now two months up, two months old. Um, he's nine, nine weeks as of this, as of last Friday. Today is Monday. So he's nine weeks going on 10 weeks this Friday. And I'm so excited to share with you all my favorites, especially because I am a breast pumping mom. I might as well say breast pumping. I breastfeed and breast pump at the same time. Um, so I breast pump majority of the time so it's kind of like exclusively breast pumping but then also like around nighttime before he sleeps I do put him on the boob um, for him to fall asleep sometime or just to get him that extra oomph but majority of the time like I said I am breast pumping and I want to share with you all my favorite breast pumps because I have a lot of breast pumps <laughs> and um, preferably one of the breast pumps I did get through my insurance which I recently got and baby for the past two days I've been turned and lit using their thing okay anyways so the first breast pump i want to show you guys is the uh, motive brand now this motive brand um it is an affordable brand you can find it at um walmart you can find it on the well its website and then you can also get this through your insurance as well but um this is one of my favorites sorry i'm looking down at the, at the um pump so this pump, I'll, I'll post a picture as well. I'm just showing you the pump itself because I don't want to carry all that stuff. But it comes with the tubes that come through here. Um, it also has the bottle and all of that. But anyways, this, you know, I love this brand. Um, there are other brands, but this is affordable. Okay. So this is my pump that I use when I'm sitting down, when I'm just settled. Now, I started off with this pump. And the thing about this pump is you, um, you're sitting in a wall, like you're by the wall. You can't go nowhere. I'm like, I, when I say wall, I don't mean it like that. It just, it sounds so like boring when you say that, which it is boring. But I'm literally sitting and I can't move <laughs> when I use this pump. So I use this when I'm actually like chilling, watching TV. Um, and since y'all saw on my last video, if you're an OG and you've been here and you've been watching my videos, I've posted a video sharing with y'all where I've been sleeping at and literally downstairs 
on the couch and I have my whole setup now. I think I recorded a portion. I'll put that so you can see where my little setup, everything that was supposed to be in this room is downstairs pretty much. But anyways, that's this pump, my fave. Now, because I, um, now because I was wanting to get things done around the house, I need a pump so I can get things done around the house. So I decided to go on Amazon and pay for this pump. It was like $79. I'll link it in the description area because it basically reminds you of the Mom Cozy Pump, but it's not. It's called Gold Gold Deep. But I'll post um, a video of what my supplier has got. I've gotten from, with this um, Gold Deep. I really, really, really love it. Um, it's good for on the go, like when I'm at church or um, I'm in public. I don't, I want to be discreet about me breast pumping and stuff. So it's this pump here. Yeah, I have two of them, of course, for both breasts. And then it goes out on top. You turn it on, and it does what it does. And um, I use this while I'm really on the go outside of the house like i said trying to be discreet and breast pump that's my favorite thing and it was 79 dollars very very affordable y'all these pumps are affordable so if you're watching this you could just definitely um check out the link in my description and get you an affordable pump a pump so this is your first time um being a mom second time first time or fourth time like me definitely check those out and you of course if you're trying to breastfeed so because i love the Motive brand so much. Now, I know I got that pump where I can walk around, but for me, I, I felt like I wanted something that was going to suction because that pump, I'm a, you're probably going to hear from me and other women that talk about um, the handheld breast pumps, um, hand-free, I mean, those hand-free breast pumps, they don't pull as much suction out. They don't suction as much. They don't pull as much out as much milk out so i decided to go back to um you've been hearing i don't know if you heard about like the insurance companies paying for your um your pump or whatever i decided to go on there see if i can get me an, um, a pump through my insurance and i saw that they had a motive brand hands-free which i think is called the aura if i'm not mistaken i'll put that in the description as well and i'll link i'll link in the description and i'll put it right here as well it's the hands-free one so basically, this goes around your neck like this, and um, the tubes go to the bottom. So the same um, pump tubes and I mean pump accessories that goes to this also attaches to this. However, of course, when this came in, this came with its own bottles and uh, pumping tools and everything. So I use this. I've been using this for the past couple of days when I'm like, cause it's, it's a bottle and it's suction a lot more than the one from Amazon as far as the one that's like the cups inside the bra. This one I also use for my bra as well, but anyways, oh, that, you get the picture of what I'm trying to say. Child, I'm tired. I ain't got my baby in me. The last time I was in this position, in, the, on, in front of this, I had a baby in me. <laughs> but anyways, I've had a long day. My son graduated and He's in pre-K, so he graduated pre-K. Anyways, let's finish this. So, yeah, I love this pump. This is one of my faves right now. And like I said, I've only had it for two days, but I've definitely been using it, and it does what it needs to do. It gives what it needs to give, sis. Now, another one of my favorite things, I'm not going to raise my shirt to show you the bra, but I will post a video of me when I first got the bra. Um, I love this breast pump bra that I got from Target. Now, I do have my friends that was telling me, girl, get on Amazon, get you some more affordable. Baby, I got some double D, triple Ds up here. I need something that's going to hold these things up. I went, I did the affordable bras. I got two affordable bras from Walmart. Um, I ended up getting an affordable bra from Ross. Mm -mm, that ain't work for me. It just didn't work for sis. I need to get me a nice, sturdy, ready to hold these jugs up bra because they are already 50 pounds each. And then on top of the milk, 100 pounds each. I need more. I need more. Anyways, this bra, I'm going to link it in the description as well. It is $35, um, which is affordable for some, but for others, if it's not affordable, that I just want to let you guys know it is $35. 
Um, what I love about this bra is not only is it like a nursing bra where you can um, detach it and feed, but it also holds your bottle on one part as well um, when you're when you're breast pumping. So that's what I really, really want. And all the other bras that I'm speaking of, they don't have that option to hold the bra up. Now, there are some hacks on TikTok that show you how to do it, but sis, I ain't got time for all that. Just give me what I need to get and let's get it started. Anyways, that's my favorite. Um, another one of my favorite things is the rolling um, bedside cart. Right now I call it the couch side because since that's where I'm sleeping at. But it's the couch side cart <laughs> and it has all my essentials that I need. I have my, oh, which is another love. I have my, um, my wipe warmer diapers on the first row the second row i have my pump pump my pump parts um and then the third row i have my vitamins and stuff which let's get into the next favorite i ended up i'm taking supplements now which is um the one that i have is the duck um duck declogger whatever I don't even know the word. I don't even know the name of it. Anyways, it's downstairs. I should have brought that up here. I'm just going to post a picture in the video of it um, so you guys can see what I'm talking about. I'll put that in the description area. Got it from Target because I didn't feel like waiting for it to be mailed to me. Um, but anyways, this has helped my milk flow as far as my duck, my clog ducks. Like with me, I'm not one of those women that have like a lot of suction. I mean, sorry, a lot of milk supply so i have to do extra stuff to get my milk supply going um what's worked for me is water but also that vitamin um it does work as well i am still taking my prenatal vitamins which these things i'm telling you are my favorites as of right now during the newborn stage trying to feed as far as i'm um, a breastfeeding breast pumping mother another one of my faves um besides that cart is um this dresser that i got from amazon it's a small dresser that i had upstairs i'll post a video picture of it um this dresser is now downstairs next to my couch like i said everything that was up here that was supposed to be used for upstairs is downstairs next to the couch as a red now <laughs> that's one of my faves um also the diaper changing um caddy that is one of my faves right now. Like, I really, really, really am digging that. Um, what else is... Oh, this bassinet slash playpen. We bought this with the intentions of having my son use it for to sleep in, which he does every now and again, he does. Or most of the time, he'll sleep on the couch or literally in my arms, which I'm going to stop doing because I've noticed when I hold him in my arms while he sleeps, I wake up in my hands I can't even bend my hand my fingers like and it's like the blood circulation and all that and I don't I don't want anything um, long-term to happen uh, negatively with my hands so I'm gonna stop doing that however like I was saying with the bassinet playpen we bought it with the intentions of him sleeping in it um, we do use it more often for diaper changing um, sometimes he sleep in it like I said or sometimes he sleep on the um, couch area next to me make sure if you have not get you a rack those racks that um that you hang the bottles on not a rack that has like the grass it's cute to have a little grass part lifted up whatever but my thing is build up bacteria and germs i don't like that so whenever you have the rack water build up y'all and it makes it turns different colors and everything whenever you're drying stuff it don't just dry automatically i'm telling you if you got one of those little grass um warmer i mean not warmer grass um uh what is it called i can't think of it bottle racks or grass racks to um to for you to dry your bottles and stuff if you have one of those look between those things and see if you got germs and stuff if you've been look, using it for a while and haven't washed it look between the child you're gonna see some some dirty stuff okay and you can be like ugh, yuck so i literally got a bottle rack i think it's called munchi i don't know the name of it munchies or something like that uh, i got that brand they do have a dr brown's brand as well and i saw that it ross for cheaper so another tip sis if you have a ross near you everything that you see as far as like getting bottles dr brown phillips avon bottles um even wipes and diapers um go to ross look in the baby section and you will find it sis and it will be like half off versus getting it from target and walmart 
anyways, the reason why I say that is because my bottle rack, I got it for like $13. Okay, it ain't that much, I know. But that same rack was like $7 at Ross. And if I would have known that, I would have saved like $8. $7, I'm just saying. Or $6. Six, $7, yeah. <laughs> anyways, um, then like I said, the if you've seen this video, my video before, I did get the Phillips bottle, um, Avent bottle from Ross for $4.99. When online it's showing like ten dollars and all that, you can hit, you get half off. They even have the little seat, seat which I'm gonna eventually get my baby start sitting up a little bit. They have the seat where you can sit your ba your baby in, where they can just play or they can eat. It grows with you. Um, that seat is like thirty five dollars at Ross when it's like fifty sixty dollars at Target and Walmart. I'm just saying, you do the math, sis. Um, but anyway, I don't even know why I got on that. But that was a tip. <laughs> Another one of my faves, you guys, is getting you a um, a bottle cleaner. I don't know if a lot of people use this or not, or they use their hand. I don't know. But if you are um, watching this video and you're trying to figure out, ooh, something in my eye, and you're trying to figure out what you want to get your baby, and the reason why you're watching these videos is to see, okay, what do I need to prepare for or buy? These are one of the things that you really, really, really need to buy. Something to clean your bottles with. Right now, I use regular dishwash soap for my baby's bottles and stuff, but they do have dishwash soap they can use for babies, which I will eventually transfer or go do that or whatever. I don't know when, I just know I want to do that. <laughs> but my, but one of the things I do want to share with you guys is make sure you get a cleaner for your bottles in the, the bottle rack, like I was saying. Another fave that I love during this time is baby detergent. Y'all, I love using baby detergent. It just smells so good. And to know that my baby is using something that is good for his body, that's all that's good for me. Like, I really love the idea of that. And I literally, I mean, I had a lot of baby detergent. And I right now, and I use it almost every day, okay? Because he goes through clothes, clothes, clothes. Um, make sure you get you a basket. If you don't have a basket, make sure you get you a basket because you will need that. Your baby is going to, if you haven't had the baby yet and it's your first baby your baby is going to go through clothes okay like crazy you're gonna be rewashing 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 and wearing the same clothes so um yeah get you that get you one of those also with the breastfeeding going back to what i my faves as far as that um i do love my last breastfeeding um i mean breast milk bags I love these bags. They are small. I do have the Motive brand. They sent it when they sent the um this. What is this called? When they sent this with through my insurance, they sent it. They sent it twice actually. They sent it with this box when they, that came in this one with this, and then they also sent it um as a like one of my when my insurance company was able to get it. I got get it out. So Aeroflow is who I went through for the insurance um, to get this breast pump. And they sent me, um, what is it called? An email, text message, or whatever, saying that I can get breast milk bags. Like every now and then they say, oh, you can get this or you can get that. So I got breast milk bags for free for my insurance. And then with postpartum, they sent me like these um, body shapers. I got that as well. These are also my faves. I use my body shaper faithfully. I use my... Um, I haven't used the breast milk bags yet because I'm using these. However, those breast milk bags look pretty big. So I'm trying to run out of these first and then I'll use that. Also, get you some nursing pads. Sis, I woke up this morning because I was told that if you um, sleep without your bra every now and then, it'll help your milk supply come in. They ain't lying because I don't never leak like that, like how I leaked this morning. This morning, I was soaked. My pillow was soaked because I decided to sleep without a bra. Sis, who doing it again? I will be having my nursing pads on because when I say I was wet, soaking wet, okay? And I ain't talking about that. <laughs> Anyways, another one of my faves is Pampers Brand. Y'all. Y'all, 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 y'all. Pampers brand. I love Pampers brand, okay? So, the reason why I love Pampers brand, because we tried it. Y'all, I tried it. I tried. Dang, I tried. 
I really did try. So my in-laws had bought uh, some diapers, um, which are parent choice di diapers. And first I was telling my mother-in-law, no, nah, good, no, nah, I don't want it, I don't want it. But they did spend their money, so I was like, okay, since they spent their money and she had already opened the box, um, we couldn't take it back to go get our own diapers. So I was like, okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and use them. And we decided to use, sorry y'all, we decided to use them and my baby was up all night, okay? I was like, oh no, 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 okay? Not doing it, not, not gonna happen. <laughs> Cause he was up all night, he kept waking up every time he had a dirty diaper, so, um, I was like, I ain't gonna see diapers. So we went to go get some more Pampers with the pa well diapers with the Pampers brand to use at nighttime until we run out of the Parents Choice Pampers or the that's a brand. If you're new here and you don't know what Parent Choice is, it's a Walmart brand. Anyways, we use Parent Choice during the day just to get those out of the way and use those, and then at nighttime we use our um, Pampers brand until we run out. Like I said, because my bed. I'm a Pampers girl. I like to get my rewards and everything. So if you ain't got the app and you got Pampers, sis, if you stocked up on Pampers, wipes, diapers, whatever Pampers brand thing you got, you better go get that app and get those rewards, honey, because we sure did use our um, coupons from the rewards to get them Pampers, okay? Period. So that's a tip, too, and that's a favorite, that app. Um... But yeah, I think I told y'all all my favorites as of right now. And if I have any other favorites, of course, I'll just add them all to this video. Um, but this video will be posted soon, so I don't know if I'm able to do that. Anyways, 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 yeah. If you made it to this part of the video, thank you so much for watching. Go ahead and put me some hearts in the comment section or give me your favorite or let me know what your favorites are in the comment section. Let's talk. If you guys are new here, go ahead and subscribe to my channel welcome to the family if you already have um and then if you are a og y'all i have some questions um that i want to ask what do you guys want to hear from me or if you guys have any questions definitely send those to me so i can do a q a video i always want to do a q a video and i really 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 want to do that so if you have any questions i am an og when it comes to the um motherhood or whatever y'all see motherhood university because i got four kids i am an og when it comes to this so y'all got any questions let me know and i'll go ahead and do a video come on let's work together help me help you let's help each other period um anyways if you made it to this part of the video again go ahead and put me some hearts in the comment section or like i said let me know what your favorites are as a new mom or what you think you will use as a new mom um or as a og mom <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, again, thank you again, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Like I told y'all, I'll make it to y'all uh, if I have any other favorites, and yes, I do. I do have more favorites. Um, I did think about it. Um, I have, um, I do have more favorites. I know I told y'all, I'll make it to y'all if I have any more favorites. Yeah, my video, I did that whole video, and I did not feel like re-recording that video. But anyways, I like this lighting better right here. I'm cute. This video sucks. But anyways, I hope y'all liked it. I hope y'all got to this part. Um, but I told y'all I would mention to y'all if I have any more favorites. And I do. My favorite is the the nipple cream. I use Lancelot nipple cream. And I also, when I first got home, I used the Medela. Uh, so whichever one. Lancelot is a little more softer to me, not as, not as sticky, but I do like that one. So, um, that's one of my favorites. But yeah, if you made it to this part of the video, again, send me some hearts in the comment section. Go ahead and subscribe and like this video. And share it if you know anybody who's looking for anybody needs some tips on motherhood. And if you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comment section. I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye. Yeah. Yeah.